Welcome to PCOA's Healthy Tidbits for Staying in Place. These sessions are brought to you by the certified instructors who are normally out there teaching PCOA's Enhanced Fitness classes. Um, my name is Marty. I am the Enhanced Fitness Coordinator, and I'm going to be doing a 30-minute low-impact aerobics session, a standing low-impact. Okay, so I would like you to uh, make sure that you have a safe area. I'd like your feet to be safe and um, the surface to be cleared off. We're not moving around. You'll be going side to side here in place. That's about as far as you're gonna move, okay? I'd like you to have a chair behind you in case you decide you want to be seated, okay? And um, do not move into pain. Remember, that's our guideline. We are having fun and we're here for our own health and being in pain is a good tool that the body uses to tell us that we're doing something wrong. So we're gonna breathe, I'm gonna you know, uh, remind you a couple times that um, it's important to have your breathing be as healthy as you can. So think about breathing with your belly, softening your belly a little. Have some water uh, here to, for yourself to have a little water break anytime you'd like, especially with it heating up a little bit. And then of course, to always have fun with this. Okay, I'm gonna turn on the music. Okay, here we go. We're marching, being aware of our area, chair relatively close. Okay. And I'd like you to add your arms with this, thinking about pulling back the elbows a little bit. Pull back, pull back. Uh -huh. And then we have the tempo crossing to the opposite arm, um, the opposite leg. And back we go to marching. Good, let's inhale. Again. Good, and marching with those arms moving again like you were. And back to cross curls, so tapping opposite leg. So low impact aerobics, march again, march, 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 means that we're not ever jumping around with two feet off the ground, okay? It is sometimes a good idea to consider keeping your low impact even lower, so like this. Now my feet are staying on the floor, you see that? And I'm lifting my heels, little heel marches. I like this step a lot anyway. So heel marches, we're gonna do single, single, double, single, single, double, single, single, double, single, single, double, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Yeah. Let your hips move a little bit. Boom, boom, chip. One, two, one, two. And back we go to marching, marching. Okay, remember this can be heel marching also. Mm -hmm. Ready, add your arms again like we were, swinging those elbows. Yeah, really swinging the elbows. Inhale, big arms up. And relax down. 
Now take both arms up and down, up and down. Ready, one up, one down. And shoulder shrug, go lift, drop, lift, drop. Cross, cross, like you were, tapping the outside of that leg, outside of the leg. Couple more. And back to heel marches. Remember, we lift, lift, lift the heel. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. Add the hips a little bit. Uh huh. Couple more heel marches. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. Back to plain old marching, plain old marching. Inhale, big arms. Ah, shoulders up and down, up and down, up and down. Single shoulders, lift, drop, lift, drop. Both shoulders again, up and down. Yeah, heel hits, just forward we go. So with any cardio exercise, you are looking at the uh, concept of endurance. You're doing a level that you could maintain for 20 or 30 minutes. Cardiovascular exercise, work in your lungs and heart. And as I said, you want to maintain a level that you could do for an extended period of time. And marching, back we go. You should actually feel, after you finish a cardio workout, you should feel a little energized. You know, it brings oxygen in, warms things up. If you feel like you have to go take a nap right after you get done with class, you might have been working a little too hard and not getting your oxygen supply. However, if you were working at your own good level of aerobic training, which should feel like you're working a little hard but not too hard, then as I said, you can expect to feel energized. Okay, so again, I'd like you to locate your chair. All righty, we're going side to side, step, touch, step, touch. And your arms comfortably swinging. So this is a classic move, just side to side here, touching right beside that instep on the other foot. Step touch, step touch. We're gonna fancy it up a little bit. We're just gonna step touch, then touch in, in, in. So those I call touch in. Step touch again and touch in, okay? Touching in. Here we go, one step touch, now touch in. Yeah. Step touch again, and touch in. We'll do a couple more, step touch, touch in. And again, step touch, touch it. Now that's it. And march in place. And if you get like flustered with any of these steps, just feel free to come back to marching in place. It's a really good place to go. Shoulders nice and relaxed, spine nice and tall. And here we go, out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in. 
wide, wide, narrow, narrow, add your arms, add your arms. We do four more. And switch legs. Go other side. Out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in. Out, out, in, in. Four more. Go out, out, in, in. Okay, switch lead again, alternate leads. So out, out, in, in, tap and go, other leg. Yeah, you're just doing one and one. Out, out, in, in, and march in place. I could have done a better job getting you down to that, sorry. <laughs> Let's go out, out, in again like you were, one leg. One leg, out, out, in, in. Arm is following, foot. So four more, four, three, two, last one. Eight on the other leg. Go out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in, out, out, in, in. And four more. Three, two. Now we'll switch lead and do four. Out, out, in, in. Two, last one, now switch lead again for four, and three, and two, and here we go, switching lead for two, two, and other side, go two, switch lead, out, out, in, in, uh-huh, other leg, two, now single, so out, out, in, in, switch lead, Switch, up, up, in, in, yeah. So you see we can take up a lot of time with that too, trying to focus on getting our teaching. One more, each leg, and march in place, go march. So heel hits forward, heel hits across. I'd like you to locate your chair again. It's nice and close. It's not going to trip you, you know, backwards tripping. That's not fun. So hitting across, a couple more. All right, tap back now, tap back. Kind of look like you're cross country skiing. It's kind of a nice picture, isn't it? Tap back, tap back. And we go half tempo. So back you go, a little drop, up, together. Other side, back, a little drop, other, uh-huh. Step back, a little drop, and step back, a little drop. Up we go, march, march, march. March, march, march. Okay, now we tap out on the side. Tap out, tap out, tap out. Mm -hmm. I'd like you to punch across as you tap out. Punch and tap. Punch, punch. Okay, now do two on one side, two, and switch, two, and switch. Ready, do four, four, three, two, now switch, four, three, two, now switch, four again, four, three, two, and switch. One more set for four, three, two, and switch. Ready, back to two, and two, and two across. Two across, single, punch and punch, punch and punch, and march in place. Okay, so you can see 
locate your chair again, please. You can kind of move us around without even meaning to. Ready? Just stomp two times. Stomp, stomp. And for four, and four, Four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one, four, three, two, one. Again, four, three, two, one. Two more. March, march, march. March, march. Back we go to tap backs. Act like we're cross country skiing again. A little bit of a lean forward and make yourself super long, graceful. Good, we're marching, marching, marching. And we'll stay facing forward and tap out on the side. Tap out. Good. Do four, please. Four, three, two. Switch sides. Four, three, two, and switch. And again, switch. One more set. Go four, three, two, and switch. Last one. Four, three. Two and switch. We're marching, marching, marching. Always our good filler. So you're welcome to get a little drink of water. You know, if it's right here by your chair, take a seat, take a drink. Back we go, We're marching. Alrighty. So we're gonna tap forward with the one foot and back with the opposite. Tap forward with one foot, back with the opposite. Up we go, back we go. So up tempo, go forward, back, forward, back. Go up and back, up and back. Now just tap forward, please. Tap, tap, tap. Actually a little stomp. And now move it. Tap forward, tap forward, tap forward. And then back to the pattern. So it's right foot forward, left foot back, or left foot forward, right foot back. It's just that opposite foot goes back. Or back. Good, marching, marching, turn if you were turned a little sideways because I did. <laughs> okay, just want to have you see what I'm doing. Okay, so we're setting up the other side. We tap forward and back. One foot forward, other foot back. Tap forward. So you kind of, it's a full count move. Two, three. Well, oh, never mind. Now I'm confusing it. <laughs> it's a tap forward and a tap back, and we pick up the pace. So here we go tap forward, tap back. One, two, three, four. There it is. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Forward and back. Forward and Forward and back. Yeah. Just move your body, lengthen your spine. Remember, movement is good. Probably your cat's the only one watching. They're always nice, right? Your pets love you. And we tap with that forward foot. Tap, tap, tap. Uh -huh. And we go again, so forward, back, forward, and back, 
two, last one, and march and turn if you return. Uh -huh. Does march likely mean it moves those shoulders? And the cross palm march again, like you did in the very beginning. So touching the outside of the opposite leg and not bringing the knees in at all. Keep them nice and pointed forward. Yes, and now just heel hits on the side, please. Heel hits on the side. Locate your chair again. Okay, we march in place and we go again with that out, out, in, in. But this time I'd like you to make it like a V step. So it's out, out, little forward, a V step. That's what we call this V step. Now add your arms. And we'll do four, three, two, and switch lead, other leg, forward, forward, back, back, out, out, in, in. So you have this V step. Yeah, sometimes I picture those Arthur Murray footprints on the ground for us. But we're not looking at our feet. We're staying nice and tall, gazing at the horizon. Four, three, two. All right, switch your lead again to four, three, two. And switch your lead again. Four, three, two. Okay, no arms. Go again. Four, Three, two, and switch legs for four, three, two, last one, march, 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 march. Locate your chair. Okay. Yeah, so we're marching wide, march wide, march wide. Let those hips and shoulders move a little bit. And then bring your feet back together and switch to heel marches. So heels are up, but add the hips. Let them move a little side to side. Now single, single, double with this move. Single, single, double. <laughs> I messed up, sorry, single, single, double, single, single, double. One, one, and one, two, one, one, three, four. <laughs> it's late. One, two, hold, two, one, two, hold, two. Couple more, single, single, double, single, single, double. Okay, marching place. So one last. Uh, move here uh, in this kind of march thing. It's called a squat out. You just step out and step out. So make this as wide as you like. Okay, out and squat outs. They're called squat outs. And last one, marching. Good, good, good. I assume you're doing great at home. Punch, punch, punch. Other side, punch, punch, punch. Good, cross with your punch, four, three, two, switch leg, uh, arms, four, three, I told you it was late. Switch again, punch, four, three, two, and switch, four, three, two. Now do two, please, two punches and switch and switch, and switch. Single punches, go, punch across. Good, 
Good. Now just punch up, 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 up. Punch, punch. Good. Add the same side leg. Same side leg. Four more. Three, two. Ready? Squat out. Let's go. Squat out. And squat out. Squat out. And squat out. Good. March. Locate your chair. Again, you're far enough away so it's not going to hit you in the back of your knees, but it's right close there. Okay. We got a little invisible chair we're lowering to. Invisible chair. Any kind of squat is always really a good, effective exercise. However, you're paying attention to your knees. You don't want to hurt the knees. March in place. And we're going to do one more set of squat outs. Here we go. Squat out. That's it. Punch up. Punch up. 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 Ready? Lift the leg, same side. Up. Up. Yeah. Marching. Okay. Just one more thing here, a little twisting. Twist. Forward. Twist. Forward. Twist. Forward, up tempo, stay, stay, you know, stay looking forward with this. And twist, twist. Ready, half tempo, go, head goes also, pause in the middle. So it's side forward, side forward, to the side, forward, to the side. Forward, one more each side. Ready, up tempo, stay facing forward. And marching again. Locate the chair. Okay, I'd like you to turn sideways, please. So we're gonna step back with one foot and just do our little hamstring curls. And I'd like you to switch this so it's a heel, hip, toe, tap. Heel, hip, toe, tap. Heel, hip, toe, tap. Okay. Now just tap your front toe. Kind of work that ankle. Okay. Heel hits forward, heel hits. Heel hits, heel hits. And we'll turn a little bit to the other direction. Okay. So that we can do our hamstring curl over here. Hamstring curls. So we're trying to keep the working leg from moving forward. Keep that kick in the back. And let's just do four more, please. Four, three, two, last one. Here it is, the heel hit and the toe tap. Heel hit, toe tap. So you got a nice little bounce in your step. Heel hit, toe tap. Oh, righty, march here, march, march, march. Locate your chair, march three and clap, one, two, three, clap, one, two, three, clap, two, three, clap. Two, three, clap.